All right, I believe this is a great find. I think it's a great find. This is a mobile home. It's for sale. And destiny brought me here. I believe I'm in a miracle situation because I just needed one of those. I needed this one badly. And I was driving somewhere in Ohio, in the border of Michigan and Ohio, and I found these. Now, I want to show you the setup. There is one there, there is one there, and there is a truck there, there is another truck, and then these two. So that seems that this yard here on the main road is used for parking, you see? Somebody have this spot and people are parking their vehicles for sale. I believe so. You see, it says for parking, Call this number 419-262-4524 As you can see there's one here parked and one here parked and one of those One of these two it will be mine very soon. I hope so now I have to handle the logistics of moving this boy From Ohio to New Jersey now. Let's see if I'm gonna like the mathematics the price and everything else because these guys, they are very well preserved as well in New Jersey as well. Now, I don't like it. It's too expensive. But we found something else, you see. Uh, yes, my favorite. My favorite is here. Is it two doors? Two doors, fantastic. Is it in good, in good standing? Is it in good standing? 1986 $11,500 yes these are the numbers uh, vinyl top is good well it's a perfect uh, not perfect you know like nearly let's say I put it this in good condition uh, yeah this one is, is lovely I love this one it's not original paint unfortunately the model it's not it's not my favorite it's a little bit newer version of what I like this one is 80 in the 80s my favorites are all the way up to 70 75 and that's it after 77 I kind of don't like them it is uh, this is 1986 and there's something else maybe this is for sale too no maybe not all right yes it's for sale this one is a uh, $10,000 or best price. What we have here is Nissan. Uh, well, sorry, but $10,000. No, no, no. Uh, Sentra, yes. Now, these are other vehicles here for sale, I guess. You see this whole parking, it's, it's vehicles for sale. Where you can park your car and uh, somebody can sell it for you or you just put your number and leave it here to be sold uh, probably people in ohio this one is subaru and call amanda but there's no price here anyway subaru here uh, that's an interesting car i like this one that's a very beautiful car it is for sale it is 2004 Arizona car, no rust. It's asking eight thousand and four hundred and sixty. Eight thousand four hundred dollars. This one, eight thousand four hundred dollars. Well, this is four thousand five hundred. Four thousand five hundred. Now I will show you if you, if you have the money or if you decide or if you are in Ohio, four thousand and five hundred. We have. The phone number and uh, this one is Cadillac uh, red and modern well wow, that's a good one I like this Sonata Hyundai Sonata they these are good these are good I guess the price will be too much oh wow four thousand and eight hundred that's a good price 2014 for five thousand dollars there is some you know like uh, like something here dinks and stuff but i guess that's a 
that's a normal car for five thousand dollars 10 years old car for five thousand dollars that's a good deal hyundai sonata these are good i like the hyundai's they are recently recently they are very very strong they are almost like toyotas now we have here a cadillac and this one it is 87,000 miles, or is it $12,000? Uh, well, it's a little bit pricey. Now, this one here is a, a Volkswagen. We are familiar with those European thing. Now, this has a huge sale. This is for eleven, twelve thousand dollars 12000 2017 W Tiguan. Tiguan for eleven for 12000 11900 And you can see the numbers. Uh, well, there's another one here. There's no price, but there is phone number. You can snap the phone number. This is Mercury. Ford made Mercury. I don't know too much about those, but they're not bad. Kind of, I don't know about that. I... I I just don't know about anything about those. Now that's a classic Chevy. Chevy it is for well the price it's it's we cannot see the price. I know if you can get it, but you get the number. Well, standard Chevy Impala in good condition. And now we have something that I would like. And that is for sale. But here the Everything is faded. We have no information. Well, that one. You see. That one need TLC. 351. Radial tires. nice it's nice it's nice it needs work of course it needs a little bit of work i guess that's should i say original paint i don't know maybe the original paint patina is here it's a good well it looks good and it looks uh, like a beast galaxy 500 good car i like it uh the interior has tinted windows in the back. The interior is good. There's uh, enhancements. I can see enhancements. I guess probably it's it's one of those jumping cars. I don't know. Maybe there's like system in the in the back. All right. Now, why did I stop here? I stopped for the for the moving homes. Now, for those of you who are into the business of tracking, now let's see. Let's see this. Well, that is Volvo for sale. 4195080589. If you are in the tracking business, 40k. 2015 Volvo, $40,000. Well, I don't think you can ever take uh, $40,000 for that, but that's my opinion. Huh? You see? In my opinion, my opinion does not count here. Uh, yes, but sometimes it does count. So, yeah, uh, Volvo, they are good. They are good trucks, very good trucks, but I don't think for this you can get probably 25 max, even 20. I would say, but that's, you know, if you can make money. Uh, plus this, what year is that? It looks very old. 2015 yes it's 10 years almost 10 year, almost, almost 10 years probably thousands of miles many many thousands of miles now that one that one is 2008 and that looks like a like a decent truck 20k mileage 2000 216,000 20k well I believe, I believe all the vehicles here are heavily overpriced. It's my opinion. It's my opinion. 
like this one for eleven thousand dollars forget about it you know i mean like somebody will buy it but it's not a good deal it's it's not a good deal for that condition i've been traveling all over the u.s and i would say a good deal for that would be 5k that would be like a super good deal but now it's asking 11. now this guy this boy here it's asking 13,500. It's 1995 Ford Pace Arrow. Yeah? Guess what? I found one of those for free. For free. In New Jersey. Of course, uh, I had to remove it from the property. I had to do a lot of work. I had to fix some stuff, but it, it was free. Now, this one, supposedly it's working in working condition, but yes. I just put the batteries here well I'm supposing that this is in perfect condition and you can just uh, drive it off the lot but uh, $11,000 for 1995 in that shape and that condition in my estimate it's grossly overpriced uh, yeah nobody will give you that money why? Because you're in competition with the brand new that can be leased for like five, six hundred bucks. Brand new, 2024. And you can lease them for five to six to seven to eight hundred dollars. Why would you pay ten thousand dollars for a... Uh, okay, it doesn't matter. This one is from Indiana. It has Indiana plate. This one seems to be okay. There is a sell price. There is no price. I love this motor home. It's this one. It's called Holiday Rambler. Or uh, I don't know what is this called. It looks nice. It looks like uh, very <laughs> vintage. You see? If you want to be the vintage guy, if you want to feel vintage, you get one of those. And there's something else here. This one is... This one is Fleetwood Dakota. Uh, it looks like it looks like garbage. Of course, it's not garbage. All all you just have to do is to clean it. You see, after you clean it a little bit, it will look like brand new. It's closed. No, it is open actually. You can go inside. Well, somebody is doing work. There is some tools here. You see, and. Uh, This one is good if it's $2,000, in my opinion. $2,000, $3,000 for this would be good for you to convert it into something else. Like uh, mobile food production on wheels, something like this, or a t-shirt factory on wheels, or something like that. Uh, for $2,000 maximum, I would give. It's me, you know. You can pay more. I know you can pay like ten thousand dollars. Some people pay some crazy money for those. Uh, some some people give it away for free. You see, that's the point. Some people give them away for free because they just bought the house and in the property line there was something like this old and ugly, and they say uh, we want it out, and they give a give it away. In Jersey, this happens often. Yeah, you can get some of those vehicles for free. In New Jersey, I know for sure. I don't know how is it in other states. Maybe in other states it's similar. Sometimes people buy a house, huge property, and there is something sitting in the, in the house, and that is garbage for them, but for some other people that's a treasure. Sign up for more of those finds. I travel all around the United States, and I usually find some stuff and when I see stuff like that I usually stop take a look see the pricing uh, and do a little video for you thank you